Hey guys, in this video we're going to be going over the best settings for your Alienware AW2723DF monitor. And we're going to do this step by step. So of course, first things first, what you want to do is you will need to open the OSD menu. You need to do this via the joystick. So just press the joystick at the back of the monitor to access the on-screen display menu, which is the OSD menu basically. And then you want to go ahead and choose the right preset mode. For example, if you're gaming, choose game. If you're doing general use, just choose standard. Or if you're doing some content creation, choose creator. And then you want to, of course, also adjust brightening uh, and contrast. So for brightness, what you want to do is you need to set it to about 80 for a bright room. Or if you are in a darker setting, change that to 60. Okay. And contrast, you want to adjust it to 75 for balanced visuals and then what you can also do is you can enable hdr mode so navigate to the display settings and toggle hdr mode on if you have hdr content and if your operating system is compatible with it and then of course you need to choose custom colors go ahead and calibrate your colors make red 96 green make that 98 and blue set it to 96 and then of course you want to also set gamma to 2.2 this will give you natural tones and then if you want to also optimize motion clarity, what you can do is in the game settings, you want to enable overdrive, okay, and set it to extreme for fast paced gaming. Maybe you're doing playing some racing games or first person shooters, you can enable overdrive in that case. And of course, what you can also do is you can enable uh, adaptive sync. So go to the game settings and activate G sync if you're on uh, Nvidia or free sync premium pro if you are using AMD. And you want to ensure that it's actually enabled in your GPU settings for a smoother gameplay. And what you can also do, of course, as always, you can open your system's display settings and you can set your refresh rate to 280 hertz for, you know, those ultra smooth visuals. And of course, you can also customize the alien FX lighting to match your setup or turn it off for you know distraction free usage and of course at the end guys you want to go ahead and save everything exit the menu and you can enjoy your monitor it's really that easy and simple guys so i hope you found this guide helpful and if it did provide any value to you consider smashing the like button as well as subscribing to find a solution i'll see you in the next one